New details tonight on some alarming allegations against the former spokesman for the city of Miami. Rene Pedrosa is facing several charges related to child pornography. He resigned from his position days after alerting the mayor uh, about the investigation. CBS 4's Kerry Codd is live for us in West Miami Dade with new information in the case. Kerry? That's right, we're learning a lot of new details from Miami police. Rene Pedrosa was the communications director for the mayor of Miami tonight. He is in jail on several criminal charges, including promoting sexual performance by a child. Rene Pedrosa served for about a year in the high profile position of spokesperson for the mayor of Miami, Francis Suarez. On Friday, Pedrosa walked into Turner Guilford Knight Correctional, charged with sending a picture of his private parts to a 16 year old, touching that child, and soliciting sex from the victim. These are very serious charges, very serious charges. Miami Police Chief confirmed that Pedrosa met the underage victim on social media and they had their first meeting at Miami City Hall. Police say Pedrosa asked the child to City Hall to discuss web design. Police say while there, Pedrosa touched the victim inappropriately. The arrest report says the defendant stopped, grabbed the victim's hand, kissed the victim on the victim's lips, and grabbed the victim's buttocks over the clothing. Investigators accused Pedrosa of sending the child a picture of his private parts and requesting a picture from the victim. Police say they they also have text messages between Pedrosa and the victim. In one message, Pedrosa said, I'm home by myself. You can come over, according to the police report. The victim responded, Renee, I can't do that. Also, knowing I'm a minor just made me even worse. The victim and the victim's family reported the allegations to Miami police. The focus should really be on the victim, the family of the victim that displayed an incredible amount of courage to come forward and report this crime. Police say they recovered seven electronic devices from Pedrosa's home. They obtained enough evidence to arrest Pedrosa on these charges, and they are going through the devices with federal agents. Police say the investigation is ongoing. This arrest is being made today because we have probable cause to make an arrest. That doesn't mean that there isn't more charges forthcoming. The mayor of Miami released a statement today. It reads in part, the residents of Miami deserve the highest standards from municipal employees. I will always work to ensure that my administration delivers accountability and takes action to uphold those standards. I have spoken to the mother of the reported victim and assured her that this is handled to the full, full extent of the law. My thoughts are with the reported victim and the family, and we expect the legal process to take its course. Renee Pedrosa was a longtime television news reporter here in South Florida. Many of us had conversations with him or were acquaintances or friends with him. Police also tell us they aren't aware of any additional victims, but the case is ongoing. Live in Miami, Carrie Codd, CBS 4 News.